Hey, exciting times here in the game room. We have a new box and it is the Lit Joy Crate Magical Edition year 7.2. So uh, the second half of the final book and uh, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows part two are the movies. Uh, let's see like that. So normally Lit Joy Crate only does these boxes a couple of times a year and this is the last one based on the books and the movies so this should be a pretty good box I have high expectations we'll see what happens but here we go okay wow all right so right away we have the daily profit which I don't know, I think this might be the cheat sheet. So we're gonna put that to the side for right now and go from there. Um, so, a candle. Fiend fire, blazing fire, peppery citrus, and dark magic. Okay, a candle. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see. Just a candle, I'm surprised it didn't have a lid or anything just uh just a candle with no topper so maybe it's in there maybe it came off in shipping but we'll see what happens and i guess we'll go with this cute little box it has a picture of a gringotts vault with one hufflepuff cup multiplied hufflepuff cups um, some coins on the front and a note here, beware the goblins of Gringotts, cast many spells to protect the items found in their vaults. This mug may multiply if handled and can get quite hot. A dishwasher and microwave safe. This Slit Joy exclusive mug was designed by Anastasia. So I guess it's a mug. One of my not favorite items because I've got plenty of mugs, but let's see what it is anyway. Okay, so it looks like, oh yeah, so there's Gringotts with the dragon on top and the rest of Diagon Alley around the outside. Um, and then we have the Huffle, Hufflepuff cup in the center. So not a bad mug, but don't use mugs. So not a, not a fantastic start, not a bad item, but just not for me. So next we have this uh, white cardboard sleeve on a box, and then inside we have a small black box. Looks like magnetic strip, so we'll open that. Oh, okay. It looks like one of the tincture bottles that you use to put the memories in. Let's see if I can read what that says. Oh, it says always. So I'm gonna assume this is Snape. This is Snape's memory. It doesn't open or anything, so just a nice little crystal decorative thing. So, not bad. I'm gonna put that back in its box so I don't end up breaking it. So set that to the side. Um, okay. Some sort of tube. Uh, it looks like the King's Cross Station from Harry's dream when he meets Dumbledore, and they have the quote from the movie and the book in there on the back side and even a picture of Harry and Dumbledore walking so let's see what's on the inside no it's a print I believe yeah there we go so let's see what we got here oh there we go Harry and Voldemort battling on the ruined Hogwarts grounds with uh, everyone standing in the background. So I like it. Good print. It's quite an odd size. I don't know that I would be able to find a frame for that. So that's a, it's a very wide. I mean, look at that. It's crazy, but, but it's a good print. Okay. Start next, we'll go with the little box. So. A small little black box it says until the very end in it. Uh, I'm sure you can't see it. Maybe there until the very end. So 
Look closely into the stone to see the names of those that accompanied Harry until the very end. So a little note to let us know. And then I can't, oh, it's a keychain. Okay, so a representation of the resurrection stone in a keychain. It says to look very closely. It looks like it's see-through. Oh yeah, you will never be able to see this, but there are names written in that tiny crystal in the center there and that you can read. So uh, I'm gonna have to say I like that. That's a neat item. I've never seen a keychain quite like that before. So uh, don't know that I'll ever use it, but I'm intrigued. Um, so we will go with this black bag, draw, drawstring, open it up, see what's inside. Okay, small wooden box. Together they make one the master of death. Let's see what's in there. Uh, okay, it's a pin that came out of its packaging. Let's put it back in there and show you. So it looks like... I don't know if you're going to be able to see it too well. But it definitely has the Resurrection Stone, the Invisibility Cloak, and the Elder Wand all making the symbol for the Deathly Hollows. So, uh, a good pin. That will go on the pin board. And the box, it's nice. It's, it's actual wood. So, And I think that's magnetic. Look at that. So, Alright. Some thought was put into that. And it even came in that little bag. Not bad at all. Um, we'll go with this. <laughs> the, let's open them so you can, so there's no glare for you. We have a pair of socks. Ugh. Open up. And they are called Not My Daughter, You Bitch. So, <laughs> nice tie-dye. Socks, I don't know if they say anything on it. I think they have a W, either an M or a W, I guess, depending on which way you're looking at it. So we're gonna go with uh, Molly Weasley. So, socks or socks. Uh, okay, a, a little bit of a heavy box with all kinds of uh, stars on it. If you have to ask, you will never know. If you know, you need only ask. Let me see if I can figure out how to get into this. So maybe a diadem, the gray lady. Okay. Okay. I, this is an interesting item. The Lost Diadem of Ravenclaw as a hand mirror. I don't want to shine the light right at you, but it is very nice. It's it's metal, like this is, it's a very good quality. So interesting. Again, I like it. I just don't know what I'm gonna do with a small hand mirror like this, but uh, very interesting. Definitely something I've never seen before, which is quite a theme with these boxes. And then we have, oh, I thought this was the last item, but there was a, a whole mess of stuff underneath it. So we will uh, start with this. It looks to be a photo album. Um, let me see if I can open it. feels like leather or pleather and it has this it's kind of like an owl I don't know if you'll be able to see the eyes up here and everything um, and then it has uh, a little design in there let's see what we got in here and yeah that's it seems to be a photo a blank photo album that you can put your stuff in so 
pretty good. I can definitely uh, get some use out of this. A lot of photos I've got stored on my phone. Maybe now I have an excuse to print them out. Put them in there. So let's move on. Okay, let's see. We have uh, Pure Totem Locomotor. I've always wanted to use that spell. McGonagall sticker. And I don't know if you can tell. All the statues are reflected in her gown. No, you really can't see. Um, we have our pack of trading cards. Playing cards. I think they're playing cards. Let's see who we got this time. We have Dobby as the Four of Hearts. We have Neville as the Five of Hearts. We have um, Tonks and Lupin as the Eight of Hearts. Looks, appears to be Bellatrix as the Ten of Hearts. And then we have Voldemort as the Jack of Hearts. So I definitely don't have a complete set because I haven't gotten all these boxes. But those those are a neat item. If I did have the complete set, I that would be pretty neat. Okay. This is an advertisement. They're doing a magical subscription crate starting October 2020. Um, so going to be looking into that later. See if we do that. Probably. But uh, let's see here. Last time we got one of these, it was a Bellatrix bookmark. So let's see what we got this time. If I could open it. There we go. Still doesn't want to come out. There we go. Uh, it's Still, it's the wooden bookmark. We have Neville holding the sword of Gryffindor on one side. And Nagini on the other side. So very cool. I like it. Nice, good, sturdy bookmark. Can't go wrong with that. So we'll take it. And now, speaking of bookmarks, we have their magnetic bookmarks. So let's open this up. We have Ariana Dumbledore in her picture frame, Severus Snape, and Dumbledore with Fox. And they're all uh, cartoon drawings, which is not my favorite, but these are not good. Man, they make these things hard to get into. Okay, let's see. Yeah, you can kind of see it there. So Ariana, Snape, and Dumbledore. And again, these are the, the magnetic type bookmarks. You put them around the page, and then they stick to themselves, so you can't lose your spot. So get that out of the way. And then we have a, another ad for the Lunicorns membership. Just a, uh, oh, it's a sticker. It's a sticker of Luna Lovegood Spectrospex. So, not gonna join the Lunicorns, but thanks for the sticker. And now we have an envelope. It says Padfoot on it. Theme to the inside, looks like it's taped closed. Oh. And we have a repaired picture of Harry with his parents riding on a little broom that they describe in the movie and in the book. And then here is the letter that they that's ripped in the in the book that uh, Lily writes to Sirius thanking them for the broom that he gave Harry for his birthday. Was it his birthday? But uh, pretty cool. I'm gonna have to. To read that later and see what I can do with that. It's a very unique item that I've never seen anyone have any sort of merchandise related to that, so pretty cool. And now we have a it's like a manila envelope with the tie, and inside it looks like Harry and Sirius. I don't know, that's cartoon drawing. Let's see if I can open it. Feels pretty thick, like there might be more than one thing in here. Oh yeah, there's a whole stack. Okay, so let's see. Me and my godfather Sirius at Grimmauld Place 1995. So yes, we're gonna go with Harry and Sirius in cartoon drawings, black and white picture. And now let's see this one. Teddy's birthday, April 10th, 1998. Tonks and Remus Lupin, first family photo. 
So right before the Battle of Hogwarts. And here we have Weasley Wake Up Call, seeing if Ron remembers the Aranaya Exame spell, 1996. So I feel like these are meant to go along with the photo album. My two best boys, James and Harry, Godric's Hollow, 1981. And then my best mates, Luna, Neville, Hermione, Ginny, Ron, and me, Hogwarts, 1997. Albus Severus, first year, platform nine and three quarters, September 1st, 2017. Very cool. So, some black and white old timey photos. I'm gonna have to read the cheat sheet to see if they're supposed to go in there. Ah, and here it is. A cork for the candle. It's not very snug, which is probably why it was all the way at the bottom, but at least it came with a topper. Okay, and the last item in the box is the last page of the book. Harry Potter and Deathly Hallows, and all of it is, let me put this down so I can get close, all of it is kind of blurred out, except for at the very bottom, it says, all was well. So, I don't know what to do with anything like this, it's, again, a unique item. Um, so, okay, so we'll see what this, and this is definitely the cheat sheet. It's set up like the Daily Prophet. They always have some pretty cool cheat sheets. So, I mean, look, it's it's very cool. I mean, the cheat sheet is almost like an, an additional item in these kind of boxes. So, yeah, the final battle poster and King's Cross Station Tube. So, yep. This is, it's going to take me forever to read through all this later. We have the Potter family album. Okay, so this was a family album, and we do have the collection of photo memories, uh, the fiend fire candle, the theft of the Hufflepuff cup as an enamel mug, and they all they have a story about every item. Um, Neville Longbottom woodmark, the Deathly Hallows wooden box and enamel pin, a letter from Lily Potter to Padfoot, R Rowena <laughs> Ravenclaw's diadem mirror. Um, Professor McGonagall spell sticker, Molly Weasley socks, the always crystal memory vial, the collector's trading cards, the resurrection stone keychain, the magnetic bookmarks, uh, they got their photo challenge, the all was well. The final sentence on the final page of the series still gives us chills. So, pretty good. Overall, a good box and a lot of unique items to end this series on. Um, some items I'm going to get some use out of. Some some items are going to end up in the closet, but that's the way it goes with every box, it seems. So uh, I look forward to reading through this and finding out what they're going to be doing next and seeing where that leaves me. So thanks for joining me, opening this last box from the Joy Crate, and uh, see you next time. Bye.